What is up guys, GCMS here and welcome to a new hybrid squad builder. As we can tell by the title, we've got a full inform hybrid today and it's a pretty expensive one, but nevertheless uh, I don't usually spend my coins too much and uh, I've realised this so I'm going to start doing a lot more expensive squads as well as some more budget squads for those who don't have as many coins. Remember, if you're looking for multi coins for a cheap and reliable source, go to utcointrails.com, link will be below in the description. So I've altered the 4231 and this squad also does include a new man of the match card. We start things off though with the goalkeeper. And actually guys, if you didn't miss, uh, if you did miss my video from earlier, sorry, I don't know, a potential AS Monaco squad. So if you want to go uh, check that out, there'll be an annotation somewhere on the screen. And, uh, so we can start things off there with the goalkeeper, and, uh, obviously 4231. That goalkeeper's gonna be Hugo Lloris. And he cost me a 205k, and I must admit, there's a massive upgrade in game, uh, compared to his normal. I really, really didn't, uh, enjoy his normal too much, but this guy saved me a lot of chances, and I probably lost a few, but uh, this team, I guess, saved from the beginning. Didn't have any handicap, I'm surprised about this, uh, but he got a really very good goalkeeper, he plays for Tottenham Hotspur. Our right back is going to be a Brazilian, that is Danilo, um, he is a uh, player for Porto, he's got some very good pace, very good uh, shooting everything for a uh, right back. I think every, yeah, every stat is above 68, uh, the heading isn't really too important though for a right back in my opinion, um, he's got good defending at 78, and he's also got, he's 6 at tall so he's got a bit of height about him. He cost me 21,000 coins, so he is one of the cheaper players in this team. Our left centre back is going to be the player that links with uh, Hugo Lloris, which is uh, Koscielny. And Koscielny, this is his second in form. He's 6 at 1, got 76 pace, good defending, or very, very good defending with 87, good passing and good heading as well. Costing 66k, so he's pretty budget, uh, uh, quite a cheap um, centre, uh, second in form from a Premier League as well. Very good pace in him as well. And uh, the other centre back is going to be a blue, and that's going to be Mangala. This guy's one of my favourite defenders on the game. Uh, got 81 pace, 6 at 2. High defensive work rate, what more can you ask for? Also got very good uh, heading and defending stats as well. Uh, left back, we're going to have a uh, player I've wanted to use for a while, which is Jose Enrique. And uh, Enrique for me, he's absolutely solid. He's very, very strong, very quick, and uh, he's got very good defending as well, with 83 defending. Cost me 74,000 coins, and I uh, was to get the blue banes, but I've never uh, never tried Enrique, and as a Liverpool fan, I thought I'd give him a try. And uh, we're going to go to uh, this side now. And the right centre defensive mid is going to be a Hua, a, why do I say Hua? <laughs> Joe Martinho. Um, I've actually butchered his name then, but his stats overall are very, very nice. And he costs you 31,000 coins, very, very good in the CDM role though. Play to Porto, his high, high work rates mean he gets knackered quite a bit. Um, and he's got 80, 85 fitness after I think it's about four games in a row. So he does go down quite quickly. Uh, that's probably expected. Our right centre defensive mid is going to be a blue, and that is Mikel Arteta. Um, I did change this, this was going to be Carrick and Gerrard uh, as a combination, but Mikel Arteta got some very, very good stats, everything above 73, and uh, that 85 um, shooting and 91 passing comes in handy quite a bit. It starts off a lot of attacks, 125,000 coins as well, so it's pretty cheap for a blue card from the Premier League. The left cam is going to be an 89 rated player, which is Santi Cazorla, and uh, he cost me 288,000 coins. That 5-star weak, uh, weak fit is unbelievable though. Uh, got so many assists, scored a fair few goals as well from the uh, left-hand side. And he's got all-round stats. I mean, that nice two passing again, very, very nice to have. And this right cam was the key player of this squad, which is uh, Gundogan. What a player. I've never used him as uh, in form before. And oh my, his passing, his goals, he's just, he's perfect as a cam. <laughs> I don't know uh, how he'd get any better, really. Four-star skills, four-star weak foot. Costs 120,000 coins for an 81 rated player. So he is quite pricey, but nevertheless, very, very good uh, to have on that right-hand side. The centre forward is going to be a blue, and that is 90 rated Mario Goetze. Uh, he's got very, very good stats on his card. 89 pace, 85 shooting, 90 passing, and 94 dribbling. Four-star skills, four-star weak foot, and um, for me, worked very. he worked to treat in that uh, centre forward role. Cost me 380,000 coins, so he is uh, quite pricey, but a uh, very, very good player. Uh, link straight with Grindigan. Um, or Gundogan, he's still calling Gundogan. <laughs> the striker then is he one of the new man of the matches, and that is Mario Gomez. Uh, Gomez though, he was a bit of a letdown for me. Scored four goals in six games, so not a good goal to game ratio at all. Uh, seemed a bit sluggish. His shooting was very good though when it when it came to it. Because for two hundred seventy thousand coins, just get yourself an S fine or something. This team, you can get the whole thing uh, without the informs, and it is a lot cheaper. Um, but it's a very good uh, side. Definitely had a lot of fun playing with it. I believe it costs over 1.8 million coins. I, I have the, that in the title somewhere. Uh, but still, it's a very, very expensive squad. Got a quite a nice bench going on there as well. But if there's any players you want me including a, uh, a further squad or a future squad, sorry, 
Comment there below. And also comment below uh, what you thought of the England versus Brazil game. I mean, it's a half time at the moment and it's absolutely shit for us. <laughs> so if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.